Today I want to take a look at creating a ground-based coordinate system in Trimble Access. Now, the workflow here is I'm going to set up a, pro or a job in a U.S. state plane coordinates using grid coordinates, so grid distances uh, between the points I measure. <clears throat> I'm going to go out in the field with a GPS receiver, set a control point, measure that control point, and then go back into my job properties and use that control point to scale the job from grid to ground distances. So I'm here in the projects page. The first thing I'll do is open up this project or create a new project if you need to. Need to. I'll just create a new job. This is gonna call grid ground. And then I'll go down to my coordinate system. And again, I'm gonna select from library and I'm gonna set this up in US state plane grid coordinates to start with. So United States, NAT 83, I am working in North Carolina. So I'll choose North Carolina 3200. I will use a geoid model. And again, I'm gonna start off with my coordinates in grid. My project height for this area is around 350 feet. So I will enter that and store it next and accept. And you see I'm hooked up to my GPS receiver already. So I'm gonna go ahead and set a nail in the ground, set a rebar, whatever you guys do for control and measure that with my GPS unit. I'll go to the menu at the top left, go to measure, choose, I'm gonna use my VRS survey style, uh, my local uh, network here, choose to measure points. Put my control point in the ground there, here's my source list. I am using VRS CMRX, so I'll just accept that. We'll open up a connection and go ahead and measure that first control point. All right, so my point name, I'm just gonna start with one and call it a CP. This is control, so I'm gonna do an observe control point. It's a three minute measurement, so I'll go ahead and edit out like most of that measurement and bring you guys back in just a second. So I will enter and measure that and I'll see you guys back here in just a few seconds. All right, so my three minutes is up through the magic of video editing that only took a couple of seconds. And you see I've got point number one on the screen. Now I'm ready to use that point to scale from grid distances to ground distances. So I'll go back up to the menu at the top left, go to my job, choose properties at the bottom, click on my coordinate system. You'll see right now it just says North Carolina 3200, United States NAT 83. So I'll click that, hit next. And now I want to switch these coordinates here from grid over to ground. So I'm going to do the drop down menu here and I'm going to choose ground calculated scale factor and let the software calculate the scale factor for me. Now, you could also, if you had a scale factor to key in already, you could use the keyed in scale factor, but I'm going to let the software calculate the scale, uh, the scale factor for the point that I just set. So I'll choose that. Scale, uh, scroll down a little bit. You can do local or uh, grid coordinates. Local is just latitudes, longitudes, grid coordinates, northings and eastings, it doesn't really matter. Since I have a point in the job though, I've got point down here at the bottom. I'm gonna select it, choose point number one and you'll see it automatically got the latitude and longitude for those points and it got the northing and easting for that as well. And up here at the top, just above that, I now have a ground scale factor of 1.00058640. So now all my distances from this point will be scaled by that amount. So I will get true ground distances. Now I just have to click store, next, accept that. Now before I do that, you'll see, or as I do that, let me go ahead and open that up again or go back to the property. Sorry, I clicked too fast. But you'll see now it says North Carolina 3200, United States NAT 83 and ground at the end. So that indicates to us that this is now being scaled to ground coordinates from that first control point. So I'll tap accept and go ahead, open that job up. Now I'm ready to go ahead and do my regular survey work.